Good morning, everybody. It is the first day of my new job. I am um, showered and ready to go. It is now a quarter after seven in the morning. <laughs> I have to be there at eight o'clock. So um, I have been wide awake since 5.53 this morning and off and on all night long. I knew I wouldn't sleep well. Um, it's just the excitement and the nervousness and all that stuff, you know. So anyway, uh, what I wanted to talk to you about this morning is guess what's back? I'm going to do my Making It Work series, but I'm still looking for a, a better, catchier name for this series. Um, it is my work week makeup. That's what it's going to be all week long, Monday through Friday. I'm going to do it every day. Um, this, this year, I am also doing a Project Pan Roulette which starts tomorrow. By the way, happy Halloween. <laughs> anyway, tomorrow is my birthday, and I wanted to start a um, Project Pan Roulette, which you have already seen by now. It goes up tomorrow, but this, here, this video will not be up until a week from today. So anyway, um, you'll be seeing a lot of the same makeups. I am going to use... My, I've got two palettes in my project pan, and I'm going to use one of those at least one day a week. One day a week at least. And I've got three lipsticks. I'm going to use two of those every single week. So I, you know, so I can get them used up. So anyway, let's get going. I have already put primer on my face. I'm not going to put um, foundation on because I don't know how warm it's going to be in that kitchen every day. And as you guys know, already know, I sweat pretty good. So I don't want to put foundation on if I'm going to be sweating. But I did put um, the Laura Geller spackle on. It, it says on there that you can use it with under foundation or alone. So I thought I would try it today. Just, you know, to see if um, this is the neutralizer, see if it would help any. So here we go. First thing I want to use today is my Ulta Brow Tint. You guys know that I absolutely love this. And this is in my Project Pan. Not going to go too crazy today because it's just a lot of like lunch ladies at work that probably don't wear a whole lot of makeup. I don't know yet. I have not met anybody except for the um, manager and must be like maybe the head cook or something that I met. She was very nice, whoever it was. I don't know who she was. I'll find out. So I have no idea what I'm going to be doing today, whether I'm going to be observing, whether I'm going to be doing orientation stuff um, or what. I have no idea. Okay, so this week's palette is going to be the um, Modern Renaissance palette by Anastasia Beverly Hills. I need to get using this palette, and um, this shadow is actually in my project pan for the year. So, just that one. I want to use my Ulta Eye Primer. That is also in my project pan. And using this every day, it should go quickly because uh, it's almost empty the way it is. I would say if it lasts me a month, I will be lucky. And that it, that will be um, someday a makeup repurchase. Even though I've got some that I need to use up first, I will be repurchasing that one because I absolutely love it. Let's see here. I want to go in kind of light today. I don't want to wear anything too dark.
That's going to be kind of the theme. I don't want to wear anything too dark to work, I don't think. Dum de dum de dum, I have no idea what to wear. This eyeshadow is so buttery soft. a little bit and then we will be done with my eyes for the day. good. And I blew my nose very well right before I came on and of course it starts. Okay, so today I used this one which is Tempera and then I used Burnt Orange in Primavera for my my uh, crease and my lid here. Okay, I love this palette that it bends back so you can see things well. Okay, for my eyeshadow today, eyeshadow, my mascara today, I'm using the Tarte Tartist that is also in my project pan. So you will be seeing some of these things that I wear all week long a lot this year. When I use something up then I can choose another thing from my project pan box which uh, I only chose 15 things and there were started out with about 70 between 70 and 75 things in that box. So there's a lot left in there to choose from and this is going like I said for a whole year I'm not sure that I like at all the way this just pops in and out. It it doesn't have a screw top. I need a haircut so bad. That might come this week after I get paid. My uh, unemployment. I, I have to pay some of my rent. I am think I'm going to get my post office box back. Or a different one, of course, probably. They probably have given mine away already. See, look at this. After I do this, that's the outside of it. So, that's why I don't care for it. Okay, for blush today, I'm going to use this one here. This is my, my Torina Tarantino blush palette. This one, as you've seen before, came broken. So I actually got this palette for free from Hot Look. And this one here I'm going to use today. This whole palette is in my project pan. brushes off after in between here and I am going to use my Becca opal today 
again in my project pan. Most of this stuff is this week. That's what it looks like. I don't have, you can already see the rings, so I don't have a whole lot left to go on this one. And I got this brush a long time ago. This is a NARS brush, isn't it? It doesn't say NARS. I don't know. You guys tell me. And for lipstick, I this one is not in my project pan. <laughs> this is number 665, Lust for Blush, and it is a Maybelline matte. So pretty. This is one of my favorites. I really like their mattes. Okay, so that one will stay out. All right, that is my makeup of the day. And thank you so much for watching. And I will see you tomorrow. Wish me luck. I'll let you know tomorrow how my day went. Happy Bye -bye. birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday, dear me. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> I don't know why I still get so excited about my dang birthday. But, you know, because I haven't gotten presents in years, um, I did get a present from a, a very good friend, and I will let you know that. As soon as the camera comes on, my nose starts running. <sighs> so anyway, I had to th just throw on a shirt. I have a, a black shirt that I wear to work. But I don't like getting dressed until I'm ready to walk out the door because of Buddy. So anyway, my makeup for the day. Um, I'm not going to show you the stuff that I'm wearing every single day, but um, now the Anastasia palette, I wore these two again, same as yesterday, probably the same as a lot this week, and then I, I, my look looks pretty much the same, I wore this one today, I wore that one yesterday, I wore this one today, <laughs> a little bit light, and for my blush, I wore this one today. This is the one with the sparkles in it. And for my lipstick, I wore the Wet n Wild Metallic Liquid Lipstick in, I think this is Peony Express, yep, which is this color here. And I got those from Leah. Very pretty. All right. So that is it for my makeup of the day. I'm going out to dinner with my mom as soon as I get off. That's my birthday present, and that's a good one because we're going to go to um, a, a place called the Cattleman's. We're going to try that for a change. You know, you never know, though, because she wants to go at 4 o'clock when I get off work. So we'll see how uh, if they're even open at 4 o'clock. If they're not, we'll just go somewhere else. We'll go have Chinese or something. So anyway, I will talk to you tomorrow. Oh, my first day of work. Didn't go as I had I had thought because they will not let me sit down except for my breaks. I have two breaks during the day. And in eight hours, I have two breaks. Usually you have three, but I have two. And so I can't sit down otherwise. So I have to make an excuse to go to the bathroom a couple times a day because I can't stand it. It hurts so bad, my back. So I'm going to try my best. I'm going to get a back brace and see if that helps any. So hopefully it will. So anyway, you know, the people I work with are wonderful. I, I think that I'll get along famously with everybody. So that's a good thing. So anyway, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good morning. This is Connie, and welcome back to my Making It Work. It's Wednesday day three of my week and um, sorry about the clothes hanging off on my deal that's my work clothes so excuse the same shirt 
but it's one that I had handy just to throw on because I don't want to put my black clothes on too much. Buddy has got a lot of white on him, if you know what I mean. So I don't want cat hair all over my, my uniform for work. So today I wore my Modern Renaissance again, of course. And I wore the this for the base, which is Tempera. Then I used um, Raw Sienna and Buon Fresco. I used this for my base and this one, this one for my lid today. And I usually don't um, do matte shadows on my lids. Lost my brush. I usually do not do matte shadows on my on my lids, but this one was such a pretty one that I thought I'm going to do that today. And who cares at my job anyway. And I used this one. This is my third day this week, so this is my third chat, third blush, and I used this one today. I should just choose one of those blushes to use up actually, um, to hit pan on instead of all three. Why don't I just go with this one to hit pan on? And then I can go on the, to the next one. You know, I wouldn't have to use up this palette. Or this just one thing. Okay, and my color, my lip color today is number 62 Matte Blissful by, Blissful by Milani. And I was going to check. No, they're, uh, their lids do not come off like elves do and it's a real pretty pink um, I normally don't wear this color pink but I, I do like this one and I love Milani lipsticks so okay guys that is my morning for you my back is killing me um, I go to the doctor tomorrow to my psychologist appointment and I am going to talk to the coordinator she is in tomorrow about um, getting some help, getting a shot in my back maybe, or something that if she could help me with. So I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good morning, this is Connie. I um, got to tell you, yesterday, you know, I uh, got to work, started up the walkway, and tripped over a curb. Landed on my knees really hard. Both of those were bloody. Um, fell on my wrist, and it's bruised pretty good this morning. That bruise just blossomed overnight and scraped up my elbow uh, it's up here and uh, so I called down my manager and told her I wasn't going to work that I needed to go to the emergency or to urgent care I wasn't going to go to the emergency room because of my wrist and so she said okay so I went out there and they didn't open till noon so I went in and to see if I could get an uh, appointment with my doctor well they could get me in it this was at about close to close to eight by that time, and he couldn't see me until ten forty-five, and he was going to sneak me in. So um, I saw I went home, saw come right back and saw him, and um, they did X-rays. They did a ton of X-rays on my lower back, my wrist, my knees, um, and so then I went home. I had an appointment with um, Deb, my coordinator, my nurse coordinator, at 4 o'clock for results of um, the study that I'm doing. And so I went to see her, and then um, the doctor's office called me, and nothing is broken. I thought for sure I cracked um, something in my wrist. But I must have just hit it really good, because it's it's 
pretty sore this morning. My knees are very sore this morning. Um, my back is always sore, so um, I can't really tell the difference. Scraped up my hands a little bit, but they aren't, I mean, you can't tell the road rash. I just have a little bit of scraped skin on my, on my um, palms. But I tell you, yesterday was rough. And then he's made, he had me go to work this morning. I, I am amazed that he didn't let me stay home for a day. So, um, I have my appointment at, at 2 o'clock this afternoon, so it's not a full day. But I'll get off two hours early today. I tell you. <laughs> if, if it wasn't for bad luck, I would have no luck at all. None. Anyway, let's get into my makeup today. For my eyes today, I use the same thing. This is in my project pan, this, this shadow right here. And then I used this for my crease. And today I used antique bronze on my eyes. I felt like going a little bit darker today. <laughs> and I, I'm having a hard time figuring out what I'm going to wear tomorrow because I'm running out of lighter stuff. Okay, for my my blush I am I chose this one I, I was gonna use the whole thing for my project pan and I I still might I have to think on this a little bit but I use this one today um, I decided yesterday I would just go with this one with my project pan but I'm thinking that I'll just might as well just do the whole thing try to pan the whole thing for the year we'll see how things go there. And then for my lipstick, this is also in my project pan, is my Matte Naked by Milani. You guys know I absolutely love, 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 love. And this is how much is left on that. So you can tell it's been used. Very pretty nude color. Very pretty. I love this color. This is one of my favorites from Milani so far. And I don't have the whole range of colors. Someday I would absolutely love to have the whole Milani line. But now I've got like five or six of their lipsticks. Let's see here. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I think I have seven. I have seven. I'd like to have more than that because I love Milani. That is my favorite drugstore lipstick. All right. I will see you guys tomorrow. Um, see how well I make it today. They, he does have to let me um, rest my back quite often during the next week. So I'm going to ask for a stool today. And hopefully he'll see that it helps me and will let me keep it. I don't know. So anyway, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.